Good morning, everybody. How are you? Oh, today's the day, right? Today's the big day for this land, for our country. And um, this morning, I just really wanted to take a minute on this historic day, regardless of who you want to win, and just send a, a message of hope and prayer. There's a lot of divisity in our land. There's a lot of hatred. And I pray for all of us that today is calm, peaceful, decisive, so we have a decision and we know, so we can all move forward. One side's going to be happy, the other side's going to be crushed. That's the real world and there's not a lot that anybody can do about that except say to yourself well it obviously is not meant to be or it is meant to be and I just want our land to be united again we can all live happy healthy lives safe so stay safe today wherever you are and I pray that that is the overwhelming feeling today is that we all keep each other safe and no violence in our land. That is really, really important. God bless you wherever you are today on this election day. It is pouring here in Houston. I feel my mother's presence today. She hated politics. She hated it with a passion. I really feel her here today, and I'm not sure why that is, um, except to say I knew, I knew what she felt about things, and I, I don't know. I just really, really feel her around today um maybe she's here watching over our family and all of our family you know i don't know how we all became so divided in our land i really don't we have one nation under god Maybe many have forgotten that. I don't know. I just want peace. Peace, calm. I want the hatred to all go away. Today, I am using a tinted moisturizer that I have had, and I actually forgot I had it in some cleaning I was doing yesterday. And so I'm trying it again this morning and boy, does it feel good. It is extremely, it's a tinted moisturizer. It is from um, Makeup Revolution. Keep doing that. It's called Super Dewy. Let me get the top because it will go everywhere without the top. Super Dewy Makeup Revolution. It is in the, um, I can't even find the color anymore. It is gone. Wait, maybe this is it. Light. All it says is light. Um, and this is it. I'm, I'm really liking it. Obviously, I was using it for quite some time because it's, it's pretty much gone. Um, it does feel very, very nice on my skin. It, it's very, very moisturizing. So I'm liking that an awful lot. I'm obviously wearing light blues today in honor of my mom. She is really heavy on my mind and was one of her favorite, favorite colors. So I am wearing this 
was also one of her favorite dresses that I had. So I am wearing this because she is definitely on my mind and I feel her today. All right, I'll just put on my concealer, which is my Makeup Revolution Concealer, this new concealer that I'm trying. And I do like it, I must say. It is um, very, very hydrating. It feels really good going on, and um, it helps my under eye area. I, it, I feel very, very hydrated under there, which is really good. Um, you know, when I damaged my eye the other day with my uh, eyelash curler, it's been pretty sore. And definitely sore where I yanked the eyelashes out of my eye. Down here under here. Just blending that really well. And then putting it down in the V of my neck. It is e.l.f. four color, one, two, three, four, four color contour. A product that you guys introduced me to. That really feels good. Those two products together, they're both Makeup Revolution products. And I'm, I'm telling you, I really am liking this brand. Everything I have tried from them, I am really impressed with. Um, so if you don't have a lot of their products, you might want to think about trying their um, products. The only thing I haven't tried is their, I do have some of their eyeshadows. I don't have any of their blush and I don't have any of their um, mascaras, but I might give them a go. Next week, we might do a Makeup Revolution entire face. I don't generally do those, but um, maybe it's time that we, we change this up a little bit here. Okay, let's get our, our powder going. Today, I'm going to use an Ellen Tracy. eyeshadow palette and a blue pencil. Okay, let's see, how does that all look? Let me check my brows because I think I just took a pretty good swipe at, a, at both of them. Yeah, oh, here it is. My mirror back here. Yep, I did, this one I got pretty good. This one's not so bad, but the other one I got pretty good. All right. Just gonna get some lip gloss on. I'm gonna use one of my Tarte lip plumpers I have my 
lipstick behind my mirror. So, okay, so that's all on. That looks really nice, really, really pretty. Those two products together, the Makeup Revolution, are really working well together. I am liking those a lot. So we're going to use this really pretty Ellen Tracy um, palette today. I got this at um, Ross, no, Home Goods, I think. Anyways, it's this beautiful um, gold. I'm going to use these gold colors right in here today because on my... Um, dress is little yellow really pretty ye little yellow like cornflowers and so we're going to go with the blue and the yellow today as a combination we need some happiness today and so for my beautiful mom that's what we're going to do we're going to do blue and yellow today All right, this is a remarkable pencil. This is one of my Davis pencils. You know, I have the full set of pencils. This is one that I bought individually, but it is Davis and I do love it. It's this beautiful, uh, has a little bit of iridescence to it, which is really flattering. Looks great against my brown eyes. So I've got that on. Now I'm just gonna sort of do a little bit of blending here. I want to just soften it down and create a little wing out this direction. Beautiful blue, absolutely gorgeous, like it's a um, Wedgwood blue, it's the best way to describe this blue. Okay, so we have got that on. Now let's look at these colors. I'm looking for a just very soft, yellow to start with. Oh yeah, that's very pretty. It's a sort of a goldy yellow color. I'll take it all the way up. Beautiful color that is. Oh, gorgeous. Beautiful. Cornflower yellow. Absolutely gorgeous that is. Just gonna dust that blue with my brush. Really want that blue to be soft today. Now we're going to take the same brush and we're going to go just a little bit deeper. We're going to put a little bit of contour color right here. This is just a little bit deeper goldy color. I don't want to deviate too much from the gold. I'm just looking for a little bit of highlight right here across 
the transitional area and up on my brow. Sorry, not my brow, the bone in my eye right here, this transitional bone. There we go, that looks beautiful. Very soft, very subtle, but definitely that just helps when you do that. That helps to open the eye this way and this way, make it wider because you're you're pulling out this way and you're opening this way. And when you have dark brown eyes like I do, you you definitely want your eyes to come forward and not go backward. That's why it's really important when you're working with all colors to be careful that you're not sinking your eyes backward. You want your eyes to pop. You want your eyes to stand out and people to see your beautiful colors, colored eyes, whatever color they are. Now I'm just making sure I have no fallout. Blending all of that really well. Going to my blush, which is my Milani Baked Dolce. All right, looks really good. That looks all really nice. Now, this dangerous thing that I've got right here. Can't believe I did that the other day, actually. Definitely did not feel good, I can assure you. I was afraid I had pulled all of them out, to be quite honest with you, because there was so much pain when it happened, and then all I felt was eyelashes falling. I'm like, oh great, I've just pulled all of them out. Now I'm just coming in with my Coco Shimmer. Bill Scroggins. Sorry about that. Thought I had turned that off. Okay, now we're just blending. This, let me finish this one thing right here. I am so sorry, I forgot. I don't know if this is an emergency, but let me just make sure. Okay, let's get some mascara. And I'm using my L'Oreal Panorama. I'm going to put my glasses at the very end of my nose because I definitely want to see what I'm doing on this eye. Trying to determine exactly how many lashes I still have here and not too bad actually it's better than I had thought I do have quite a bit still 
they are just not as long on the outer side as they normally are. So I must have pinched the lash as I was curling it and then that's how they broke. Starting down at the bottom, trying to make sure that I get all of what is remaining covered here. It's not as bad as I thought, but it is, there's quite a bit of damage. Hopefully they will grow back in and chill out like they were because they were in such, such good condition. It makes me really sad that that happened. You know, I lost all of my lashes just about with my weight loss surgery, so it has taken three full years to get them healthy and they have been so incredibly healthy and then I did this. It's just really frustrating. All right, now I'm just going down to the lower lash line and filling in a little bit. I don't like a lot down here, just enough to see that I do have some lashes. And go back out here to the outer area where these lashes were ripped. Could be worse for sure. But at least there is some there. It's not just completely bald. All righty. A little bit out on the very ends to give some length to these tubes. All right, looking good this morning. Let's get the eyeglasses on so we can see. Yeah, that looks really nice today. I do love the contrast between the blue and the gold. And then just a very little difference between the lid color, the transition color, and then the lid color again. And it is very soft, very pretty, and um, definitely complements my blue and gold dress in honor of my mom today. I hope everybody stays really safe today. Please check your surroundings, you know, with this election today. Don't take anything for granted. Pray for peace. Pray for a decision and pray for our land that we can move forward together as one. Respect each other. Respect the decision, whatever it may be, and that we all can just move past this very divisive time in our country. I am so glad today is here. Remember we tried this new dewy makeup revolution color, coloring tinted moisturizer and I love it. It is beautiful. 
gave my complexion this gorgeous, soft, silky finish in combination with the Makeup Revolution new contour that I'm using. These products together, I'm loving them. If you've not tried Makeup Revolution, give them a try. They are very, very um, competitive with price. They uh, are fabulous formulas. I'm loving the formulas, I must say. And they're easy to get a hold because you can get them at your local grocery store or drugstore. And then, of course, I used the Ellen Tracy Glam Eye Collection, and I got it at Home Goods. Very, really nice palette. Lots of different colors. Reds, mauves, golds, rusts. There's even a dark, dark brown and a black in here that is beautiful. So this is a nice product. You can get a lot of Ellen Tracy's at Ross and Home Goods, um, and they're very inexpensive, like three dollars. So if you're looking for some different type of products, her formulas are really good. She's got beautiful perfumes. In case y'all don't know that, my mom wore Ellen Tracy all the time for her perfume, and it is a, she really does have a beautiful collection. So that's it on this election day, 2024. God bless you wherever you are. Stay safe. Please watch your surroundings. Thank you for being part of my community. And thank you for helping me grow. We are definitely growing. And that is because of you guys. So thank you for sharing. And if you're new here, welcome. Everybody is welcome. We're, we're here to help each other be the best version of ourselves, to play with our makeup, feel good about ourselves, encourage ourselves to get out there and chase our gold, goals and dreams, whatever they are, to be successful. And to always help each other remember, whether you're 20 or 90, anything is possible. Hard work, faith, love, and dedication, anything is possible. Don't forget that. And never forget to give yourself a break. I don't, and I know that, and I'm working on it. Make sure you give yourself a break, too. We're only human. And love all of those around you that mean the most to you. Let them know how much they mean, because, you know, tomorrow is never a guarantee. God bless everybody. Stay safe on this election day. If you're getting out to vote today, please, please be careful. Take your time. And I pray that we have a decisive decision and that our land and our nation can come back together and move forward. Whatever God has in store for all of us. And I'll see you tomorrow, everybody. Take care, be safe, check your surroundings, and have a great day. Get out there and hit your Grand Slam, whatever it is. Of course, I want to hear back from you. So if you have any questions about what we use today, if there's a specific um, look you would like to see, if there's a specific brand that you would like to see, um, a whole look in that brand, please let me know that. And we will get working on that. I'm here to help you. I'm here to help you feel great about yourself so you can have the very best day, week, month, year, and life that you can. We're here to help each other. God bless everyone. Have a spectacular Tuesday. Stay safe. God bless.